it's Queen Bee from Honey Bee Toys and today we're going to do a really useful tutorial and this is an adult tutorial meaning that you should have your parents help you because I'm going to use a knife to make this so if you can't use a craft knife then be sure to have your parents make this but this is a really great to do thing to do if you have so many shopping containers you can see I have so many of these because I open up so many blind bags and I wanted to do something fun with it so I'm just going to take out my shoppers in here have fun drum in one of them and get my little translucent strawberry kiss charm and this one has my lippy lipstick. Oops, she kind of flew away. My lippy lipstick charm, so cute. And this one doesn't have anything in it, but I wanted to show you what I did with this, with this uh, little container. So I have so many of these little containers, and I thought that it would be perfect to make it into a little toothbrush holder. So here I have my Pinkie Pie toothbrush, and it's a spitting toothbrush, so you can see it actually spins. Um, but it'll fit any type of toothbrush. You can make it this little really fun container. So if you ever go traveling and you need a little toothbrush container, you can have a Shopkins one. And I didn't do it to any of these, but you can actually stick a little suction cup here and then you want you could actually stick it on your mirror if you wanted to and hang maybe a bunch of them up. If you have siblings that need to stick up their toothbrushes and these are cool because they all connect so you can stick them together and hang your toothbrushes. So I'm just gonna show you how to make this. It's really simple, so tutorial will take no more than five seconds. <laughs> so all I do is I take Take a craft knife, so you don't need any special tools, it's just a craft knife. And I just cut a little incision like right there. So you can see on this one where I cut, and you don't want to cut these little um, things because, or else it, you can't snap it in. So I'm just going to show you really quick. I'm just going to take my knife and you want to be careful not to cut yourself. Move your fingers away and you're going to apply pressure, but not that much pressure. The craft knife is pretty sharp. So you see I made one little incision on that side. And do the same thing on the other side. And just be really careful because the knife is really sharp. And you can go as far down as you want. I'm just going to go like halfway down because I think that's fine. And then now I'm just going to score it. So that just means doing a light mark. A light mark down like that. So I'm just going to do that a couple of times. And then the reason you score it is because then you can just take your piece and then bend it left and you can score it some more and then break this piece off. And then now you can bend it the other way and then bend it back and twist it off. So now we have another Shopkins toothbrush holder. This is so exciting. So this one fits perfectly and now I have two of them. So this is just a regular little toothbrush that I have and I can snap both of them in place. Look at that, look at how perfect that is. So when you go traveling and you need something to put your toothbrush in, you can make one of these or have your parents make one of these. It'd be great gifts. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Be sure to like, subscribe, and, and comment. And be sure to stay tuned for my big Shopkins giveaway. Thanks, and bye next joke time. What did the judge say to the dentist? Do you swear to pull the tooth, the whole tooth, and nothing but the tooth? <laughs> Do you know what a dentist does during an earthquake? She braces herself. <laughs> okay, bye now.